there was darkness between us And the road that we traveled It took us each our own way But a new day is dawning And the future looks brighter This is the beginning Peace Child, the musical play, is coming to California in August. On Friday and Saturday evenings, August 28th and 29th, Peace Child will be performed by an international cast at the Thousand Oaks Civic Arts Plaza. The young people of the local community will join with youth from across the country and around the world to bring the message of peace and peaceful solutions to our world's problems. Here are some brief clips of Peace Child 1992, performed at the Shrine Auditorium in Los Angeles. The play is called The Peace Child, and in this version staged in Los Angeles, it's a dramatization of how the children who are in it saw and felt the riot. For some, those who lived through it, it was terrifying. And those burning couches were the only light. Our neighbors put out the couches with a garden hose. I was afraid my house would burn down. Others, children from the suburbs, untouched by the violence and destruction, experienced it through television. Where's my cameraman? Hurry, get this on video. Oh my God, it's the end of the world. The play actually originated 10 years ago as a children's protest against nuclear arms. Los Angeles production keeps the structure of the original and the musical score. But the children's monologues, the heart of the play, are now about the riot. Mr. President, have you seen what the riots have done to our city? Yes, yes. I took a look at that riot thing. Yeah, thousand points of burning light, but they all been put out. Almost everything in the show is kids' words. I mean, the, the writer has taken the kids' words that we, we used when, in our discussions and form them in, into, into uh, drama. And it showed different sides of different stories, how different people felt, you know, about what was going on. The children also act out the moral dilemmas that they imagine real people confronted. In one scene, Alan Shmilovich plays a teenager who was sold a television that was looted from a store. It's sort of my conscience in the television, and it's telling me to take it back, and we get into a big argument about me not wanting to take it back, and then I finally agree to take it back at the end. Peace Child is about taking children and empowering them, giving kids a voice and making them feel as if they can affect change in the world. A play by a group of children may do little to solve the many profound problems of Los Angeles, but it brought together these young people, black, white, Latino, and Asian, for a few hours and maybe forever. Ron Claiborne, ABC News, Los Angeles. To make this positive statement by today's children a reality, we only need $15,000. That amount, together with ticket sales, will cover the costs of theater rental, costumes, transportation for cast and chorus, publicity, rehearsal space, and labor costs. Room and board for the performers is already being donated by the generous local community. Here are the incentives for your generous donations. For $25, you get your name in the program. For $50, you get a t-shirt with the Peace Child logo. For $100, you get a signed program by the cast members. For $250, you get a signed script by the cast. For $500, you will get a meet and greet opportunity with the cast and David Walcom and Rosie Simmons, if they are available.
and for $1,000, the cast members will be available for your event. Peace Child isn't just a play. It's a unifying event for the entire community. We always talk about leaving a better planet for our kids. What about leaving better, more informed kids for the planet? Please help us make this event a reality by giving your generous donation today. Hoping to make the world okay I have wished upon a star But then watched it moving farther away Till today